Hello everyone, welcome back to another video of The Dimensionalist. I'm a dimensionalist. Today's video is going to be about uh, that there's no space, no, technically, no empty space on Earth. <laughs> According to science, if you believe in science, and the way the science constructs uh, atoms and vacuums and space and science that you were taught in school that everybody on the earth fucking understands is what I'm about to say. You're, you're like, well, it's just empty right here next to me. No, it's the atmosphere, you dumb fuck. There's, a, there's an atomic thing being took in place. We breathe it in. That's air. We interface, touch our skin. It's called erosion. So, and that interface with all objects on earth. And that's a part of our atmosphere. So that's atoms. You know what I'm saying? That's matter. There's no space. There's no empty space on earth. You know what I'm saying? Technically. You know what I'm saying? There is no empty space on Earth. The only time that there's actually it's empty is in space where it's vacuum. That is a is a big distinction between. Well, you're like, well, I'm gonna set my I got I got this phone. I can set it over here. It's empty over here. I'm like, no, it's there's air there. It's like, well, what if I remove the air from it and all the you know the nitrogen? You know, there's no matter. There's no empty space. What I'm saying is, unless you create a vacuum artificially on Earth. There's no empty space on Earth. You get what I'm saying? Like, it makes sense that way because if not, you're saying that whatever's in this room, like right here, to move my hand, there's no air or oxygen there. You're saying there's no matter or space there. I get it. Then if not, you gotta not count atmosphere and air and just only physical matter. You can't, you can't, uh, you can't, you can't apply gas because that's a form of matter. Meaning all entire Earth till outside its atmosphere is all matter. Right? You know what I'm saying? I try to explain that to someone and they God damn it, all these people don't understand what the fuck I'm talking about. Like, think about it, dude. There is no empty space on Earth. I was like, unless it's a vacuum, then it's empty, but still there's air and stuff traveling. It was only in space where the whole vacuum's already been pulled out and it's empty. Meaning it is a vacuum in place and or objects moving. What is it where there's a it's a vacuum where there is technically no space because at that point it, it's moving whatever space or matter is already moving in that vacuum that's where it's empty you get what i'm saying that's how come the planets and everything move and stuff yeah um so that basically sums it up that's all i wanted to point out that uh if that's current science that ain't something I made up some dimensionless dumb shit I just made up it's it's real there is technically no empty space on earth if you're going by science solid wicked glass uh, four, four types of matter solid wicked glass plasma gas is one of them our physical body all objects in this room the air in this room unless it's a vacuum so what if we get sucked out as a vacuum uh, at that point and that's where it matters moving to where the other matter is you get what I'm saying that's what a vacuum does it moves matter it's just a force. So if you're like, well, I'm going to suck it out. There's still, you're all you're doing is pulling in matter. You get what I'm saying? Well, it's empty. I was like, no, it's not. Only in space, where all the objects are trying to get away from each other, where it's already pulling in whatever direction it's already moving, to where there's no technical, technically space. Because at that point, it just, it's just moving and matter is just like water and floating around in space until it stops or something, or something intervenes, the way I look at it. But yeah, that sums it up. There is no empty space on Earth. There is no empty space on Earth. <laughs> Simple as that. Peace.